Hi, my name is Whitney Mead, and today I invite you to pray with me the prayers for the national life from the Book of Common Prayer. If you enjoy these prayers, I invite you to subscribe to my channel where I post new Christian encouragement videos and devotionals every week. Let's pray. Almighty God, who hast given us this good land for our heritage, we humbly beseech thee that we may always prove ourselves a people mindful of thy favor and glad to do thy will. Bless our land with honorable industry, sound learning, and pure manners. Save us from violence, discord, and confusion, from pride and arrogance, and from every evil way. Defend our liberties and fashion into one united people the multitudes brought hither out of many kindreds and tongues. Endue with the spirit of wisdom those to whom in thy name we entrust the authority of government, that there may be justice and peace at home, and that through obedience to thy law we may show forth thy praise among the nations of the earth. In the time of prosperity, fill our hearts with thankfulness, and in the day of trouble, suffer not our trust in thee to fail. All which we ask through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. O Lord, our Governor, whose glory is in all the world, we commend this nation to thy merciful care, that being guided by thy providence, we may dwell secure in thy peace. Grant to the President of the United States, the Governor of this state, and to all in authority, wisdom and strength to know and to do thy will. Fill them with the love of truth and righteousness, and make them ever mindful of their calling to serve this people in thy fear. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, who liveth and reigneth with thee and the Holy Spirit, one God, world without end. Amen. O God, the fountain of wisdom, whose will is good and gracious, and whose law is truth, we beseech thee so to guide and bless our senators and representatives in Congress assembled, that they may enact such laws as shall please thee, to the glory of thy name and the welfare of this people. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Almighty God, who sittest in the throne judging right, we humbly beseech thee to bless the courts of justice and the magistrates in all this land and give unto them the spirit of wisdom and understanding that they may discern the truth and impartially administer the law in the fear of thee alone through him who shall come to be our judge, thy son, our savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. O Lord, our governor, Bless the leaders of our land, that we may be a people at peace among ourselves and a blessing to other nations of the earth. Lord, keep this nation under your care. To the president and members of the cabinet, to governors of states, mayors of cities, and in all administrative authority, grant wisdom and grace in the exercise of their duties. Give grace to your servants, O Lord, to senators and representatives and those who make our laws in states, cities, and towns, give courage and wisdom and foresight to provide for the needs of all our people and to fulfill our obligations in the community of nations. Give grace to your servants, O Lord. To the judges and officers of our courts, give understanding and integrity that human rights may be safeguarded and justice served. Give grace to your servants, O Lord. And finally, teach our people to rely on your strength and to accept their responsibilities to their fellow citizens, that they may elect trustworthy leaders and make wise decisions for the well-being of our society, that we may serve you faithfully in our generation and honor your holy name. For yours is the kingdom, O Lord, and you are exalted as head above all. Amen. Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, send down upon those who hold office in this state the spirit of wisdom, 
charity, and justice, that with steadfast purpose they may faithfully serve in their offices to promote the well-being of all people. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Almighty God, to whom we must account for all our powers and privileges, guide the people of the United States in the election of officials and representatives, that by faithful administration and wise laws, the rights of all may be protected and our nation be enabled to fulfill your purposes. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Almighty God, we commend to your gracious care and keeping all the men and women of our armed forces at home and abroad. Defend them day by day with your heavenly grace. Strengthen them in their trials and temptations. Give them courage to face the perils which beset them and grant them a sense of your abiding presence wherever they may be. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, amen. O God, our Father, whose Son forgave his enemies while he was suffering shame and death, strengthen those who suffer for the sake of conscience. When they are accused, save them from speaking in hate. When they are rejected, save them from bitterness. When they are imprisoned, save them from despair. And to us, your servants, give grace to respect their witness and to discern the truth, that our society may be cleansed and strengthened. We ask for the sake of Jesus Christ, our merciful and righteous judge. Amen. Thank you for joining me for these prayers for national life from the Book of Common Prayer. I'm Whitney Mead, and I hope you'll subscribe to my channel where I post new Christian encouragement videos and devotionals every week. You can also join my free video devotional series, Fitness in the Father, by texting the word Whitney to 31996 or by signing up for free at fitnessandthefather.com. May the Lord bless and keep you. See you next time.